What's up, y'all? It's your boy P. Light, aka the Brick Slinger, and guess what? Your boy got something to say. With all this stuff going on, man, I see a lot of protesting going on around the world in honor in honor of George Floyd. And so far, it's bigger than that. Now, it's big. It's not just George Floyd, but it's just the acknowledgement of the mistreatment that goes on in America with African American people. And I know there's many other people of color that go through the same thing, but for some reason they don't get the big platform like we um, African Americans do because of the history that black people in America go through in this country since the beginning of this country. The beginning of the history of this country before it became a country but I know not only the protest is going on there's also still continuation of looting and rioting like I know people trying to separate the two separate the two but there's other that still continue to keep it together like we all trying to destroy properties and this then the third but one thing for sure if you hear me out check me out man there is a major difference between protesting and looting those that are protesting they're protesting for the right reason those that are looting are doing it for the wrong reason they're doing it claiming that 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 they're angry even though some of them are but the real one the real people that's looting are not what you think it is and whether you see it on the news or whether you see it on YouTube or other social media, you see and there's people, whether they're not, either they're not black or they're not for the cause. And even there are pictures, unfortunately, of particular officers trying to set things up. But I want to salute all the police officers that is out there saying, look, we seen the video just like y'all saw the video, but... We don't want to support that. There's nothing to justify it. It's really, it was wrong. And we want to be a part of the cause too. We want to, we want to march with y'all. We want to protest with y'all. I want to salute y'all, man. Cause y'all the real ones. Y'all the true people. Y'all the, y'all the good cop people we're talking about that want to see come out and, and take a stand against, uh, uh, um, police brutality. Because those particular cops, those four cops that in Minnesota, uh, Minneapolis, as well as other cops that committed senseless racial e execution. They make them cops, they make the rest of the cops look bad. They make the rest of the police, I want to make sure I tell you right, the rest of the police bad. The real ones that really want to protect and serve, they make them look bad. So I salute y'all. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully I do get a chance to see this video. But well, here's my thing. With all that is going on, man, people are still hurting. People are still crying, man. They still t they they're tired of seeing another black person get killed in the hands of of of, of people who took an oath, who vowed to protect them, to serve them, no matter what. And we got a long history of not just that, but we got a long history of being uh, mistreated just because of the color of our skin. It's like we're not our our our, our great grandparents or our great great grandparents. We are their descendant. However, it seems like there are people get in this time in this generation are being mistreated because of the color of their skin. And it's like we don't want to, we don't, we don't want to continue to go through this. But at the same time, we don't want to be seen as this scary people trying to 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 take over things. If anything, we're not trying to take over. The scary part is that there are people still to this day, no matter what age they are, no matter what color they are, still got to go through the same same stuff over and over and over and over and it's like when is it going to stop when is it going to end and it's unfortunate that we have a president 
that that not only will never understand what's going on but it's probably won't it's not going to understand it's sad it really is sad it's sad that we have that type of leadership but at the same time there are people that have his skin tone they're taking the time to sit with a black person and be like for real man what it is that i need to know so i can do something you know what i'm saying and there's a lot of us are taking the time even in our pain and in, in our in in our hurt saying look this is what it is this is the this is our history being repeated over and over again it just continue to have a new name and it's unfortunately that our list of people black uh men and women are continuing to grow because of a of, 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 a, of a police system of not just a system but people who support the system continuing to say he that person is not worthy of living pow this person is person not one is not worthy of living knee on the neck this person is not is not worthy of living let's go through their house and kill them where they where they lay you know what I'm saying let's And, and, and as far as it's protesting, I mean, like, real for those who are really protesting for the right reason, I salute you. But be, be, be you know what? I'll even say this: those that are protecting the protests, I salute y'all too. I salute y'all the most because y'all taking the time to say, "Hey, that person is over there. It's messing up the cause. Let's get them. They're not with us. Then they're, they're not. They're not part of our stuff." They're not here to help us. They're over there uh, 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 making a scene, trying to make us scared to make it seem like the, the, the police officer that's there to, to make sure that everything is peaceful. Peaceful. They're the one that's trying to start up this race war. I know there's a race war going about to come out, but I don't know what's going on. But those that are not for the cause, and they don't even look like this. They're the one that's trying to start this war so that people that don't look like me be scared of me it's not cool but we're gonna have to work this out man cause we, we're in a time where things are getting worse every day every day whether people want to believe that this is the, 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 the end of time or this is the last day if you in, if you're in the scripture really really study the book of revelation thoroughly don't just don't just say it's the end of the world. And then there's those that I even question one and even are even in the kingdom. I'm not going to say name because quite frankly, it's not important. But I will say you, you, you that's watching this, either you're that or you know somebody that is that. They're not really lamb. They're not really part of the flock like that. Look, I... I, I like I said in the previous video, I don't care about those that come out talking about what about black on black crime or police. There are p police officers kill, cops kill people from other races. Like I said before, even though there are cops that kill other people of other races, other colors, how often do you see them in a? How often do you see their particular color or race get national national attention, worldwide attention? Yes, there are some bad cops in this, that, and the third. But at the same time, you would never find. And you think you would think that a race like the white people, if the white people, white people get killed by cops, why don't they get this much attention? You would think they would rule the world if you want to call it that. And as far as black on black crime, again, like I said before, they are never. You can never compare black on black crime to a level of cops being killed. Uh, not cops being killed black people being killed by cops you can never compare that to you y'all when those who want to feel that way y'all becoming a distraction y'all want this problem to be cool y'all don't have no 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 patient or 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 or, or a level of wisdom to want to know why because black on black crime We've been talking about it. Those that's been talking about it, we've been talking about it for a while, and it gets ignored. Cops being cop killing blacks don't get ignored. Why? Because cops are in a position to protect and preserve instead of executing. That's not their job.
So I don't care about all that black on black crime argument in the midst of this time in the situation. And those that want to scream all lives matter, y'all should be the main ones out in the front line. Matter of fact, y'all should be in front of the front line, letting it be known that all lives matter and their lives matter. And these are the reason why. Instead, y'all screaming all lives matter for, for nothing. You're black, you're white, Hispanic, Asian. In this country, if you want to scream all lives matter, okay, show it. Show it. Otherwise, stay, stay at home. Protect your family. Protect yourself. Stay out of it. But don't try to stop other po folks from protesting because... When it's all said and done, those that really protesting are doing you a favor. They're doing me a favor. I may not be out there on the front line, but trust me, I am with those who are who are screaming Black Lives Matter. Despite any other black folks that have a different ideology as I do or philosophy as I do, if they black and they matter too, whatever the case may be. As of right now, if you disagree with my with my belief, cool. But as of right now, black lives matter. Matter even even though all lives matter. Right now, the lives that matter that needs to be acknowledged the most is the one that's being demolished, being demised. And that's black folks, black lives. I don't care it well, like I say, if you have a if you disagree with what I say, there's a comment board down there. Let it long long as you disagree just disagree but don't disrespect i know youtube got the thing where they really to pull out every comment of anything that seems disrespectful so be careful otherwise if you like i say this is the, this is our this is the time in our generation and folks like myself folks poets like myself rappers like myself uh uh undercover activists Apologies out there we want to make sure that let it be known like hey this is what's up and we want to make sure that y'all get all the knowledge wisdom and understanding as possible is Jesus Christ is still Lord he died and rose for everybody but and he rose for everybody with this complexion this color this melanin and those who have the total opposite of that that disagree let's talk otherwise be careful with what you say Cause folks are still in their feelings folks are still hurting and the last thing you want to do is say the wrong word at the wrong time and as right now it seems like it's right now it's the wrong time to say any of that anything from black on black bringing up black on black crime until all lives matter now it's not that time let's 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 be wise let's be wise use some wisdom stay out of it don't start nothing won't be none as they all as we always used to say back in back then even till now don't start nothing won't be none but as it's but in that though it's your boy p lot aka the brick slinger it's always say man take care support the kingdom continue to sharpen one another take care and god bless and like i say salute to those that are really protesting salute to those that are protecting the protest and you salute to all the police officers that say hey we're not a part of that nonsense we're with y'all and we're gonna make sure that this protest is peaceful and then those who are looting and trying to start some trying to start this little race war don't do it don't do it don't do it and as you can see here on the background that's the wife say hi babe hey babe I don't call the world a babe. I was calling you babe in front of the world. Hold on. Take care and God bless. Labor's.